Death, Lady of Men, Lady of the true faith and of the true path of those who breathe, hearest my clamor. Giveth us thy blessing, giveth us thy righteousness, giveth us thy peace at the end of our journey. Only thy word is true, only thy church is the path. Thou art the end, and in being the end thou art the beginning. O lady, I beg of thee, giveth us thy protection today, that we might make thee an offer of a thousand infidels cut down by our swords. Postponeth today our inevitable end, so that our life becomes an instrument of death. By the breath, by the war, by the peace. to command, Sir Kyoban. For God has death! Stay on foot! The day is ours, my Lord Purple. The cultists are in full retreat, further into the Forbidden City. Shall I pursue? No, Sir Theron. You have another duty of paramount importance. Bring me Solon Legionis. You and Aetolos must move through the underground. Release the old subjects as you do so. Which ones? As many as you can. All of them. But the people on the streets! Alerna! The Church of Death is inside Akratia! It is too late! What matters is that you live, and with you our knowledge. What about you? Sire, please. Sire, I've followed you proudly since Death's hallowed banner was first raised. I've abandoned kin and home for the only church's cause. Please, Sire, I beg of you. Allow me the grace of rejoining Our Lady by the blade. It will be my honor, good woman. 
and take heart. The service of the devoted never goes unnoticed. Thank you. Any last words, soldier? Find those Ethan bastards. Give them a kiss of steel in Lady Death's honor. Do you accept death? With all my essence. of the first man. May the lady watch over me, for I'm surrounded by heresy. explosion originated.
creatures. What manner of unholy creatures have you unleashed upon this earth, heathen dog? What deranged blasphemy were you trying to achieve here? Speak! And lessen the burden you'll have to carry on your way to the one true goddess. It's, it's too late. Crusader of death. We have failed our goddess. And the entire cult of life will pay for our hubris. Spare me the senseless drivel, Essence Mancer. Where is your master? Where is Solon Legionis? Rot your essence, church dog. Hmm. So be it. Do you accept death? No. Not your lady. Never her. We have not forgotten our mother. <laughs> is spreading. Lady Hines was right. The Essence Mancers are indeed breeding abominations.
I am Theron of House Giomen, and I shall be known as Crusader of Death. My apologies, young lord, but your father made it very clear. You are to finish your lesson. Now, continue. The, the four first deathly high priests, may our lady have them in her honor, were Saint Samantha Hippocrate, Saint Manmin Ome, Saint... Go on. Saint Louis... <gasps> I was to be a lord, with a title and a fief, with vassals beneath me and a liege above. There is nothing to fear, my lord. It is not the first time that I caught young Theron here in the chapel at this hour. You have a very pious son. Theron, come. Come, I command. Only our lady commands. But Goddess Death had other plans for me. Begin! I will allow it. Our Holiness, the Deathly High Priestess, has summoned all the faithful. Stand aside, Father. These are my men, Theron. I am the Lord. Our Goddess Death is the true lady above all lords, sire. It is the duty of all believers I to... I gave you no need to speak. You are my father and my liege. But to threaten a holy servant of the Church is heresy and treason. your mind if you imagine I will allow it. Our Holiness, the Deathly High Priestess, has summoned all the faithful. Stand aside, Father. These are my men, Theron. I am the Lord. Our Goddess Death is the true lady above all lords, sire. It is the duty of all believers I gave to... you no need to speak. You are my father and my liege, but to threaten a holy servant of the Church is heresy and treason. Our lives do not belong to us, nor to any worldly power. I made mine an instrument of death. And in the end, Goddess Death will call my essence back to her. Death. You insolent brat! You bastard son of a whore! Traitor! Traitor! Do you accept death? Son! My son, please! Please! Do you accept death? It's all my essence. I look 
forward to my death.
Is it that I am still... No. Our lady's ways are not ours to question. I live to serve her will.
I'm an Alephus, of the Agisi Romi people, worshipper of our mother, goddess life. to our leader, Anna Lepus. May she receive our mother's blessing and endure until the coming of next summer. Thank you, my friends. Today, as this summer begins, Goddess Life grants us once again with love and fertility. Let us honor her gifts by rejoicing in the glory of being here. Now, together, blessed be our days. Don't you ever worry, Chief? Don't call me Chief, boy. But tell me, worry about what? The threat from the church grows worse every day. I don't know. I'm just afraid something might happen. Don't waste your life in fear of what may come. That's when they win, you know. <laughs> Life's to be lived, brother. What if there's no tomorrow? Exactly. Word to the wise. Go for the booze. <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> Yes, Romy. Life is not a quest for meaning, a burden to bear, or a debt that must be paid. It's a celebration. Or at least it should be. I saw it. Just from their looks, you can tell they're non-believers. Goddess, eh? Bryce just went up. Why not your crowns? One hundred? For passing through? That's preposterous. Safeguarding the roads against scum like you doesn't come cheap for the church. If you don't have the coin, however, no bother. We could always arrest you for... Here you go, Sarge. 100 crowns. Plus a little something for you fellas. Move along. That was too great a bribe, Chief. We'll make ten times that much with our contraband. Let's not get greedy. It is not greed that concerns me. It's drawing attention. To the Church of Death? Anyone not following their bleak and sad creed is the same sack of shit. They call us cultists. Like it's a bloody insult. It's a... And it doesn't matter if you're actually in the cult of life or not. Anna Lepus, you're under arrest for leading a criminal organization. They made us do it, Anna. They killed Merrick. They would kill your children. Forgive us. Take her. The bloody church hounds us at every turn. Anything serves as an excuse to oppress us. No. It's a lost cause to defy him. It's now. Ready yourself. I'm ready. Let's get out of this shit. Where are you headed? Back to your people? I have no people. I'll go where there's coin to be made. Sure you don't want to come to Akratia? 
Listen to me. That many life worshippers in a single city is bound to attract bad attention from the Church of Death. Maybe so, but strength comes in numbers, Arthur. I'm better off on my own. Show yourself. It so happened, I was pretty cut out for the assassin's way of life. I always had light feet. And getting by becomes much easier when the only person to care about is yourself. Please, please, I beg like you. I don't know whether finding that kid was a blessing or a curse. But it's what got me to Akratia, the Forbidden City. Who's gonna use this? Let's just say there is no one left to care for him. And Akratia will be his home from now on. We'll find him a family. You're an Olympus, right? Alina told me of the Sikisi Romi turned assassin. You must be one of a kind. I'm very grateful to you. You aided my friend's escape from a grim fate. I merely delayed it, sister. Why not stay? Akratia always welcomes those in need of a home. Appreciate it, but it's easier not to have one. If you find solace in your chosen path, I wish you well. May the All Mother protect you and your folk. You'll need it. And may she guide you in tranquility until the coming of the next summer. And the next. And the next. Oh, bloody hell. You wouldn't happen to have some work available, would ya? Mind you, I take point, not favours. And I ain't no assassin. Akratia was a sight beyond the wildest dreams. Roads stretching on forever, buildings so tall they brushed against the bloody clouds. It was a haven for folks like us. Enemies of the Church of Death. At least, for a while. Just how much did I drink? What have you done, vile woman? Get out of my mind! You will undo this sorcery, or else... Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! What the fuck? You and the mother's dead to you! Cease your jesting. Your corpse, witch. Was it a ruse? Whatever heresy you've inflicted upon me, I want it gone. Now! Sod off! You're bloody real? Wait, my corpse? N no <laughs> No. No, this is rubbish. <laughs> oh, it must have been more than just a drink. I demand that you... Oh, for fuck's sake, I ain't no bloody witch, you dog prick! I am just as baffled as you are! This is madness!
Oh, creepy little bugger. What the fuck is going on? Contraptions that cleanse the polluted water, making it once again fresh and drinkable. The immortal city, indeed. Buzz for me! You fancy another flog, little coach? <laughs> Merely contemplating is all. Something to tell the ladies back at home. The immortal city's excrement. How romantic. More appeal than the tales of decapitation. Pray, what holds such appeal? Forgive us, sire. Idle chatter. No harm intended. 
Do you know why, following Our Lady's teaching, our founders forbade the kind of profane knowledge the vermin here covet? It was because it can so easily infect the essences and minds of the weak-willed. So leave it be. Indeed, sir. Our apologies, sir. Keep a watchful eye on the Essence Mancer's hideout. Our scouts! With me! This all reeks of Essence Mancer's handiwork. Those green bastards are the ones who meddle with ancient relics. Some fantasy spell or ritual or whatever. Hmm. Let's find us an Essence Mancer then, heathen. If we hurt him enough, he'll dispel our malediction. That's all you bastards know, isn't it? Violence and suffering.
Well, well, well. Look over there. An essence might so. <clears throat> Goddess! He was just a bloody kid! Wait, what's... what's this? Oh, oh, it's... it's... it's, it's like something's drawing me and won't bloody relent. Hmm. So you feel it as well? I'm Tekri Haudai, servant of Goddess Life, and the youngest person ever to join the Essence Mancers. away from it. But look, Papa. He's all better now. I met him well again. No, how die, my dear. Listen to your Papa. Get away from it, please. No, Papa. I cured him. I can play with him again. See? I missed him so much. Back then, before I understood my abilities for what they truly were, my own father would have had me believe I was cursed. What you're reading, little brother? Oh, uh, hi, Kuyanlun. Well, this one's Moses Setula's history. It relates to the last days of the first civilization and the decline of the great cities. He contradicts Friar Sanchez's body of work. Can you believe it? He theorized that humankind must have lost their immortality overnight. Can you even imagine, sister? One minute, you're eternal. There are people in the world who have seen the dawn of time. Think of all the knowledge they must have gathered. And then it was all taken from them in the blink of an eye. Imagine the chaos. You little bookworm. You know, Father's really worried. The healer thinks this disease is connected to your abilities. I am so sorry, little brother, but it may not have a cure. If it were, reaches the church. Then you're going to protect me, right, sis? I take care of you, and you keep teaching me that interesting stuff. Deal? My condition left me deformed and with blisters spreading over my skin, so father didn't want the other villagers to see me. I had only my books and my sister, Kian Lena's company. What is this, father? You're sending me away? These men are here to take you to the Reparation Monastery. They're willing to do whatever is in their power to rid you of your condition. And what if they cannot, father? What do you think they'll do? It is for your own good, son. You are not taking her die! Kian Lun was badly hurt, but we managed to escape Klingazar. We traveled until we reached the kingdom of Krulisgon.
good news, young one. Your sister is going to be fine. She has a remarkable will to live. Thank you. That's all right, boy. You're allowed to feel. What you did was very courageous, and nothing short of a miracle. That you managed to keep her alive all the way from Klingazar. Life herself must be working through you. It is Haudai, correct? Yes. Pleased to meet you, Haudai. I'm Sola. They were called the Essence Mancers as an affront by some who didn't approve the use of their powers, of our powers. We liked the name. We embraced it. Solon says we must be heading out soon. He says we have a very important purpose and must not waste our time. And what purpose is that? Forgive me, sister. But I promise not to say anything about it. I'll send instructions on how to find us as soon as I can. Could... Cause you Hyun Lun went back to Kingazar. As for me, my home was no longer there. Mine became the free city of Akratia, where the glorious first civilization once rose, and where it fell. When you look... Son. If you keep on training with Aetalos, perhaps you'll become an even better reanimator. And you must keep seeking the knowledge of the first civilization. For that, you can count on a learner, the expert on all things regarding the first ones. The essence on this one remains corrupted. Indeed. I believe it's the recipient that's the problem. We got the best we could out of our flesh dolls. Time to step up. I'm proud of you, son. Together, we'll accomplish the unthinkable. Together, we'll bring back the gift of immortality. The Essence Mancers became my family, and Solon like the father I never had. One who accepted me for who I was. My head... Hear me now, splitting. Essence Mancer. You will tell me how to break this curse. What? Who are you? How are you doing this? Brilliant. Of all the bloody mangers around here, it seems we stumbled upon a clueless pot. Wait! Who? Welcome to the party, kid.
I appreciate you coming, Haldai. Oh, spare me. I'm only here out of respect for all that you've taught me. There's only one thing I wish to hear. Have you changed your mind? Haldai, I, I... Then there's nothing more for us to say. I'm afraid so. I'm so sorry. What are you... She tried to kill me. Halurna? No, that can't be right. It makes absolutely no sense. Kate, <laughs> she didn't try. She bloody well succeeded. Why would she do this to me? Why? You know nothing, do you, boy? You're just a foolish child messing with forces way beyond your ken. You're dead. You just haven't accepted her gift yet. And I've been cursed to bear your essence. The two of you. Parasitic scum, tarnishing my being like disease-ridden ticks. Alorna knew I would always side with Solon. She must be planning to take over. Damn it! I must warn my master before it's too late!
As you said, woman, it's clear that the Essence Mancers are behind this. I'll find one who can end my torment. Even if I have to slaughter every last cultist in this cursed city. What? No! Are you insane? What you're saying is monstrous. If we want some bloody answers, I reckon we should go straight after the head of the snake. Their leader, Solon. Yes, yes, you're absolutely right. He's the cleverest and wisest man I've ever known. He'll certainly be able to aid us. <laughs> Your views are skewed, child. But I, Solon, that name haunts me still. It would seem it all hangs around that bastard. I'll find him. But after he tells me what I want to know, I'll gladly put his head on a spike. Solon will be no easy task. If your church mates aren't him as well, I say we follow the corpse trail. 